Hello everyone, in this tutorial we will be looking into customizing the slides. So this is the final result. It will be like this. We will be animating the image as well as the slide and making some, some custom options to the slide. Let's start by adding ion slides and in ion slides I will add options to be equal option i will assign this option in typescript then inside the ion slides i will be adding a class of ion margin dot then inside the slides i'll be adding the ion slide and inside this ion slide i will be adding the ion card and inside the card i will be adding one image like this i will duplicate this slide for five images Now in the slides option in TypeScript, I will be adding the options. I will add slides per view 1.5. Then I'll be adding centered slide. I'll be adding the loop to be equal to and the space between I want it 10. Maybe I will add auto play later on. Right now I will comment it. We will go to homepage.scss. I will start by targeting swiper slide active. I want to transform scale to 1.05, so it will be little bit larger. I will target the swiper slide. I will add a transition, so while any action, it will be it will be with a smooth effect. I will target the ion card. I will add width of 100%, a height of 160, so it will be with a fixed height. A box shadow I don't want so I will set it as none, border radius 12 pixel and for the image I want the object fit to be covered and with the width of 100% I want to transform scale to 1.1 so it, the image will be bigger and a rotation of 1 degree, little bit of rotate and a transition of 600 millisecond so while any effect it will move smoothly inside the swiper slide active i will target the image here and i will assign the scale 1 1 so while the slide is active here i want the scale to be normal and if the image here in the different slides the previous and next it will be 1.1 and with the rotation i will save now we can notice it's applied like this. While changing the slide, we can see the animation in image and in the slide. So the image will be like uh, scale down while it's active. So it will be set as one. And once it's not active, it's default to 1.1. So as you can see in the image and in the slide itself, we can see it's bigger than the rest of the slides. So while being active, it will be scaled 1.05. So this is pretty much it. Thank you very much for following up.